Well, good morning to my YouTube friends out there. I am back, and I just have to do this review really quickly before I go to work. I have an appointment this morning, but I do want to review a product that I just got from Jeffree Star. I know some people don't like Jeffree, but for the most part, I do. If you don't want to watch this video, you don't have to. But I really, really, really enjoy Jeffree Star. Now, he came out with a summer chrome collection. And I got mine off of Beautylish. And I only bought two things from the collection because I have quite a few of his lipsticks already. Then I'm going to talk about a product that I bought that I tried to like and what happened to my skin afterwards. Um, and then I'm going to talk about a new palette that I got my first time ever getting this palette. So let me get into Jeffree Star. The um, lipstick that I'm wearing by Jeffree is called You Better Work. And it's purple. My favorite color. So I didn't think it was going to look right on me, but it matches my shirt. <laughs> But this is the color right here, and when I and it's very matte. So I'm gonna swatch it on my hand so you can see the color. So there it is. Yeah. So when it dries down, it's pretty matte. Um, so that's a good thing because you know it's gonna last and it's give you good staying power. So that's one thing. The other thing is that I am a big fan, diehard fan of Jeffree Star um, scrub, um, lip scrubs. This is one of them that he came out and it is called, what is it called? Oh, this is the, um, <laughs> the Blue Raspberry Sucker. And I tell you, this lip scrub tastes exactly like raspberry. This is what it looks like. It's blue. And I used it this morning. And it tastes really good. You can eat them. So they're cruelty free. Um, they're yummy. Ve vegan, vegan and cruelty free. That you can eat them. So I'm gonna take mine out of the box now that I've talked about that. Um, I love Jeffree Star's lip scrubs. One is that they when you scrub on your lips and you remove it and eat it, it glides on your lipsticks and everything magnificently smooth like I'm serious I'm not putting too much on it but it really does work so I have to give him that much credit he do have really really good products and I love them so one thing is is that I bought the Too Faced RX 3-in-1 I wore it for a couple of days and one thing it didn't work out for me Number one is it gets your skin too wet, and um, it broke me out a little bit. My skin reacted to it. My skin, whatever it is differently in this opposed to the cream, is something different about it. Another thing is that when I wore my eyeshadow and sprayed it, it wet my eyeshadow and caused it to be a mess. I didn't like the way it turned out. I wrote on YouTube to the um, CEO founder of this product and told him that I really, really tried to like this and I just really can't like it. So it's going back. Um, unfortunately, I have to take it back. And you know, we try things. If they don't work out for you, you got to take them back. For those of you that watch my video, when I said about the staying power, oh, it stays. It stays. But for the most part, when I went to work, I, I looked at my skin. I have a mirror on my desk. I kept checking, and my skin got so oily during the day. Like, it was just way too oily. I had to uh, use powder all day, and it was just really bad. I didn't like it. So, unfortunately, this one didn't work out for me. For those of you that might have dry skin, it might work. But for oily skin, for me, mm -mm, didn't work out at all. So, that's going back. I have the for my first Juvia's, Juvia's, the Magic by Juvia's palette, and this is the one, this is my first one I've ever gotten, and I love the packaging on this, and I got it the other day, and these are the colors, they're very, very beautiful, um, I like this here, the, the design on there are really, really nice, and some of them have a little shimmer in them. 
Um, but I swatched one of them, and they, you know, they seem to be pretty pigment. Well, I, I barely can see that. Like, I might have to wet these. I'm not sure. But it's this one right here, this orange, I put it on my hand right there. Yeah, they're pretty light. So I might have to wet it with Fix Plus in order to get the stand power of them for them to come out to look nice. So that's one thing that I, and I just got them, so I haven't tried them on my eyes yet to see how it goes. Now, when I order Jeffree Star uh, from Beautylish, a website, they give you this sheet here with all the Jeffree tattoos. I have so many of these. Um, I've collected, I got at least four or five of these. So every time I order from them, they always send me his tattoos, which are amazing. They're all over his body from the head all the way down to his toes. So anyway, I just wanted to share that with you guys. I am loving this color by Jeffree Star. Um, it won't be an everyday um, color because it's purple. And I usually try to match, you know, my colors with my lipsticks. So anyway, I love you guys out there. Thank you guys so much for watching and commenting. And I really hate that I couldn't like this. I tried. I tried, but it just it just didn't work. My best, now I'm a boy in this video, my best setting spray ever is Scandinavia. I have to say that stuff lasts. It doesn't affect me. I might get oily maybe once in a day and have to touch up with powder, and that's it. I don't have reactions from it. My skin loves it. So we have to do what our skin likes. And once it reacts to something, then you need to stop using it. So, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Leave your comments down below. You know I love my comments. And just because this is Jeffree Star video, part of it, don't thumbs me down. You don't have to watch. So hit that notification button down there the next time I do a video. And you guys have a blessed day. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.